Hey guys, I made a red decorative wall mirror with accent bases for someone and I love the way they look and then I realized that it would be a great idea to show with you guys how I made them Now let's go ahead and get started I took a round board that was a leftover from a previous project and all I'm going to be doing now is splitting the board into eight When I was done with that, I started drawing out wavery lines that I'm going to be using for the design. The wavery lines will not be drawn on the straight lines. So when I was done with this, I then took a hot glue gun and then traced out the wavery lines. And I'm going to be doing this all round. This is what it looks like. And now I went ahead and I drew out more wavery lines with the hot glue gun in between the previous lines. If you're new to my channel, it's so great to have you here. Now don't forget to click on the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of my latest videos. I love the way this looks already. And then I took a red Rust-Oleum spray paint that is a paint and a primer and I spray painted it red and then I glued on the mirror in the middle the next thing that I did was to take beads golden beads and cut them into different lengths for the design the lines that I left earlier are going to be filled with the longer beads and then around it it's going to be followed by beads of different heights I will be repeating this pattern all around the mirror. This is what it looks like. And then I took a hook from the back of one of my mirrors to glue it to the back to hang it on the wall. Now let's move over to the vase. These are the measurements that I'm going to be using for the vase I'm going to be making. And I'm using a trifold board. I carved out the shapes and I made two. Now in between it, I'm going to be using a poster board and then I cut out 1.5 inch strip that I'm going to be using to connect both pieces together to form the vase. I'm going to be gluing on more strip here because the first strip was not long enough. So when I was done with that, I then just glued on the second board to the top. This is what it looks like. And then I'm going to be drawing the wavy lines also for the vase. When I was done with that, I also used the hot glue gun to trace out the wavery lines and used the hot glue gun again in between the first set of lines. The pattern with the glue gun is going to give it an interesting texture at the end of the day. I used the hot glue gun to cover up the edges also to make sure that it comes out neat at the end of the day. I used the same red Rust-Oleum spray paint and this is what it looks like. And then I glued on the beads too. I later decided to make a smaller vase to go with it. 
The vases were kind of looking dull, so I added gems at the end of the day. And I think I prefer it with the gems. The gems kind of made it pop more. And then because of that, I had to add gems to the mirror also. I used red because I was making it for someone. But you can definitely use any color of your choice. You can also add flowers in the accent faces. I love the pattern that I made with the hot glue gun because it has created a nice texture and an interesting hidden pattern for the mirror and the vases. Let me know what you think about these decor pieces in the comment section below and remember to like and share. Thank you so much for watching. I have other videos linked in the description box below to check them out and don't forget to click on the subscribe button.